truly humble man by Jonathan Edwards. Humility may be defined to be a habit of mind and heart corresponding to our unworthiness and vileness before God, with the disposition to a behavior consistent thereto. A truly humble man is sensible of the small extent of his knowledge, the great extent of his ignorance, and his utter spiritual weakness. He is sensible of his natural distance from God, of his dependence upon him, of the insufficiency of his own power and wisdom, that it is by God's power that he is upheld and provided for, that he needs God's wisdom to lead and guide him, and that he needs his might to enable him to live a holy life. The man who is under the influence of a humble spirit is content with such a situation as God is pleased to allot him, is not greedy for honor or fame, and does not strive to appear exalted above his neighbors. Humility tends also to prevent an arrogant and domineering behavior. On the contrary, humility disposes a person to a condescending behavior to the vilest and lowest, and to treat inferiors with courtesy and affability, as being sensible to his own despicableness before God. If we then consider ourselves as the followers of the meek and lowly and crucified Jesus, we shall walk humbly before God and man all the days of our life on earth. Know God. Confess your nothingness before Him. Distrust yourself. Rely only on Christ. Renounce all glory except for Him. Yield yourself heartily to His will and service. Avoid an aspiring, ambitious, ostentatious, domineering, arrogant, scornful, stubborn, willful, self-justifying behavior, and strive for more and more of the humble spirit that Christ manifested while he was on earth. Humility is the most essential and distinguishing trait in all true piety. Earnestly seek then, and diligently and prayerfully cherish a humble spirit, and God shall walk with you here below, and soon shall present you before his glorious presence without fault and with great joy. Jude 1 verse 24